in your heart, that's great. You need to make a lot of mistakes to get there. Anything that's, I think, is successful is a series of mistakes. With American Idiot, I mean, it started off with uh, having band practices, and uh, we we came back and we, we started getting back into band practice down in uh, Billy's basement and stuff. And after, you know, literally after two or three weeks, we we're just like, this sucks. We know how to have band practice. This is not how we want to approach making a record. Um, it, I mean, even to the point where Billy called me at one point and was like, do you even want to do this anymore? American Idiot was sort of a whole new, let's take on the planet sort of vibe. You should do it at least once in your lifetime. It, I think we were kind of scared, like when we were doing demos, and, but I think that there was some point that like, you know, fuck it. If people fucking hang us, then fuck it. Day one of the record, I mean, the first thing we did, everything was about setting the goals of this record. You know, American Idiot, after recording it, we knew we had accomplished something that was completely above anything else we'd ever done.